Hi guys, me again. Uh, I used my new ghost box my husband and my son made for me to do this video of Elisa Liam. It's a short video because I was just testing the box. All the input in the box was in reverse, which makes this even more amazing, at least to me. I think you're really, really going to enjoy it. It's very informative. In the end, she talks about her afterlife and what she sees there. So it's really cool. Uh, she does talk about being pushed into the water tank. You're going to want to listen for that part. It's really, really awesome. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell for notifications and like this video, thumbs up this video. Love you guys. Enjoy the video. It's short. If you want more, I'll make a longer one. Enjoy. For best results, remember to use headphones or earbuds. Elisa, are you there? Hi, Elisa. I won't understand what she's saying till I play it back, probably. Are you there? I just want to confirm. I think I heard you say you're there. We all know what happened as far as seeing you in the Cecil Hotel. You're getting into the elevator and then you're looking very upset. Then they found you drowned in the water tank. Can you tell me what was going on in the, in the elevator when you pressed all the buttons? Why did you press all the buttons? Did you feel like something was chasing you? Was there a person chasing you? Was this person chasing you human or was it a spirit, like a ghost? Why did you push all the buttons at one time? Was there a reason for that? Okay. How did you get up onto the roof? How did you get into the water tank? Can you tell us? They said that you stopped taking your medication days before this happened. Why did you stop taking your medication? Can you tell me a little more about this man that was following you? What did he look like? What was he wearing? Stuff like that. Can you tell me a little more? Anything else about him? Was he, was he tall? Was he short? Was he carrying a weapon? Was he the man who told you you shouldn't be taking your medication anymore? Was he the man who brought you up to the roof or told you to go up to the roof and meet him or something like that? Can you explain that? Mm -hmm. 
When you were up on the roof, were you there a long time? Did you go up on the roof by yourself or did he force you up on the roof? I don't know, but it sounded like you said you were abducted onto the roof. Is that what you said? Is, can you verify that? How did he get you to climb the ladder up to the water tank? I think we have some thunder here. How did he get you... How did it get you to climb the ladder up to the water tank? Did he have any kind of weapon? Did he have anything that persuaded you, like a knife or a gun or some kind of weapon? Did he give you some kind of drug or some kind of hallucinogen? Did you feel that there was any evil spirits or any dark energy around you, like something that came from the hotel, some sort of evil thing from the hotel? So when you got in the tank and you realized you couldn't get out, what happened? Did you call for help? The person who threw you in the tank or pushed you into the tank, as you said earlier, were they staying there watching you drown or did they leave? Why did you take off your clothes? Did you take it off before or after you got in the tank? Did you think that if you went into the tank, this person was going to take you out? Can you try and give me the name of this person if you knew their name, especially if you know their full name? Can you give me their name? Is there anything else you need to tell me about what happened? I know that you're spending lots of time with your family when you visit from the other side. 
And I thank you very much for coming to visit with us, all the people who are contacting you and who love you very much. And I feel very honored that you've come to visit me. And I just wanted to say thank you. Do you have anything to say to the viewers, all, you know, all my viewers who are going to watch this video and think about you? Can you tell them about where you go, where you go like in heaven, in that beautiful place where you go after death? Do you have anything you want to say to anyone? Are you at peace where you are now? Do you have any messages from the other side? Do you want to tell them about what it's like where you are? Thank you very much for talking with us and thank you very much for being here for us. Any last words? Okay. It's so good to know that she's at least in a good place now. I am absolutely blown over by the results I got from this new box. I hope you enjoyed this session, and I hope you like the new box too. So tell me how you like it. I'm going to play around with settings and see what else I can do with it. So make sure you subscribe and hit the notification so you can get that. And don't forget, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Anyway, uh, love you guys. Love you forever. All of you. Notification. Ring the bell. I'm here for you guys. Love ya. Bye.